Hey everyone and welcome to another vlog and I realized last week I actually said October I don't know what's wrong with me but it is August the 24th today August is such a weirdly long month this year that I don't know I feel like shouldn't we be in September now but at the same token I'm like I don't want this summer to end because even though I'm not in school or not a kid anymore I still feel like you know the beginning of September when you when you would go back to school is still the time that summer ends just you know because of going through many years of school and that kind of stuff I know it's so random anyways so I wanted to start this week off again with doing another uh, spread with you and I am super happy with how this week turned out but I did a lot of my um, my avocado toast with eggs and that kind of stuff which I think turned out really really well and super cute I also added in a big picture of Ollie the derp cat and then I ended up wanting to take a there's like an Ollie sample spread where you can get like one of every kind of Ollie drawing that I, I did. So, you know, I've got one with him cleaning the, um, cleaning inside of a bucket, another one working out, another one with him eating a donut, another one working out again, and then also laundry or sheets day. I have that listed as well as I have my payday sticker. One of, it was, um, a miscut so I ended up just keeping it for myself because I still absolutely love it and um, I'm gonna start trying to be super good about also posting these at the beginning of the week on my Instagram story so if you guys um, aren't already following me on Instagram I would absolutely love it um, I am really trying super hard on my Instagram right now I um, I'm trying to figure out you know the good ways of trying to uh, build up my um, Instagram and just like the likes and follows and all that good stuff. I know it's a slow grind. Um, and then tonight, Mr. Candy and I, we just finished making dinner. I made a super delicious, I'm super excited about it. We got fresh wonton noodles and I ended up making a um, stir fry with like tomatoes and like these long sticks of bok choy and some mock meat because if you guys didn't know my hubby and I are vegan and uh, so I'm super excited about having some of that and I'm gonna bring my laptop with me so I'm gonna I want to show you guys my adorable laptop so this is my laptop cover which I always get a lot of compliments on so um, I ended up getting this laptop when I used to do a lot more um craft nights with a whole bunch of my girlfriends and here's my cute little bag uh but this also gives me a good excuse to not always be in this studio space because i work from home right now again because of covid i am in charge of a leo team now if you guys want me to go into more depth about uh, my animation background and what i do for a living and that kind of stuff i am more than happy to give you guys more of a background on me because i know that's not really something i touch upon on my youtube channel but um but yeah i i, I want to be transparent about working in the animation industry and that kind of stuff as well so you know i'm here for you guys but anyways so um, I'm gonna bring that downstairs because I'm doing a lot of drawing on my iPad But what's happening now is I'm getting super backed up with everything I need to do like the spreads and Finalizing touches and that kind of stuff that I have to do in Photoshop and it's not something I can do on my iPad So I'm gonna see about trying to do that tonight on um, My laptop and focus on that kind of stuff tonight. So I will take you guys with me We're gonna do some spinning downstairs too because I like to try and do a workout at least twice a week do like 20 minutes on um, the stationary bike while we're watching Adventure Time and that kind of stuff. So um, I will take you guys with me with doing some stuff on my um, uh, on my computer and I hope you guys have a fantastic night and I will see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye. So one day this week I ended up going into the office and so I took public transit. 
I didn't feel comfortable really filming on the actual subway just because it was really quite busy. I was actually really shocked and because of COVID and everything, uh, none of us could stay the proper distance apart. We all were wearing masks and all that kind of stuff, so we were as safe as possible. But it was the most bizarre thing because everyone's just staring at everyone. And no one's really just going about their business or sleeping or anything like that. So I definitely did not feel comfortable filming or else I really would have. And I, I'm kind of shooting myself that we didn't, that I didn't. But so this is a Lansdowne and Bloor, if you're not familiar with Toronto, and usually the road here is packed. Usually the intersection is just so bustling that you can't even get through. Everyone's trying to make a left, you know, that kind of business, but it is dead, dead, dead. I could not believe, especially since we're in phase three now, it was still really hard to believe that this is what it looked like on my way to work. So this would generally be my walk into the office if I was going into the office every day of the week. And um, I mean, I definitely save a lot of time not going into the office, but I couldn't believe how fast I actually got to work. It took me about 30 minutes or less to get there. And I couldn't remember what time I should actually leave to get there. And this is like a back alleyway that I just love going into the office because it's just so pretty. And I got there by 8.30 and then I used my fob to get into the office and then I set off the alarm. I felt so noobish, I felt so ridiculous, but I ended up calling my director and then turns out everything was okay. So if you're wondering, there's a whole bunch of lofts that are to the right, screen right of here. And so yeah, like a lot of artists and stuff live in this general area. And um, I, I really love coming down this direction. So the building right in front of us there, that's the office I work in there. And it's a old building turned into a whole bunch of offices, which is really, really cool. So um, I didn't film while I was at work, obviously, because NDA and all that good stuff. But once I got home, um, I decided I wasn't going to stream again just because it was quite late and still having dinner and all that kind of stuff. But I decided that I would work ag again on all of my uh, sticker sheets and all that good stuff and layouts because, you, you know, you need to do all of this prep work before you can actually send it to the printer. So that's what a lot of this is and excuse the noise if you can hear it outside i live on a busy street and it's kind of really poopy because of it so uh so yeah just a lot of sticker sheets and layouts and talking on discord hanging out with the community and that kind of good stuff so um yeah it's just it's just you know it is what it is it's just organizing sometimes it's really nice to just not have to draw and think about what it is that i'm going to be drawing that night and just laying things out and and just the simplicity of all of this i actually quite enjoy it it's just a lot more time consuming than you would expect it to be but i mean at the end of the day you know um i still value everything that i do work wise so it doesn't bother me any if it's gonna take a little bit longer than usual and i mean i'm just so grateful that i have my laptop so that i can do this you know in my bedroom Hey everyone, happy Saturday. So um, I'm just about to get to cleaning the house and then after that I've got a backlog and you guys would have seen me doing this. Um, earlier in the week I've been doing a lot of uh, planner pages or um, sticker, I should say sticker sheets, templates and getting them all laid out and ready to go so that I could upload them into my Cricut design space and then print them off on my printer and then cut them on my Cricut. So um, that's what a lot of today is going to be and I'm hoping that I can also do the photo shoot for everything as well. So everything that's printing off that I can take all the pictures for it and get them all prepped and ready to go for uh, Etsy as well as getting them prepped just for my um, Patreon giveaway which will go live on the 1st of September which will be a Tuesday so right after this video because I always upload my videos on Monday so on Tuesday that's when my next giveaway will be live so I'm really excited about that and yeah let's just get on with the day shall we 
Some cute little things that I wanted to show you guys that came in the mail and I keep forgetting to show you guys. So, um, as you guys probably know, uh, so I've been on Etsy for over a decade now and I love Etsy and I'm trying to buy more on Etsy than on Amazon or anything like that when it comes to just, um, you know, non-perishable items that, yeah, okay, I could buy sewing scissors on Amazon, but look at these adorable kitty, they're kitties, like it's a, it's, it's a kitty, like look at how cute this is, let me get this to focus. The other little item there, the little thing that's holding my needle is called a needle minder. It looks like it was supposed to be a button. I think it's just absolutely precious and I love, love, love that I got these on Etsy. So now it is time to get to work on all of the sticker making. I definitely had a very eventful, busy day yesterday getting all of these stickers and things ready. And if you're wondering why I'm using tape there, it's just so that the registration on my Cricut will pick up on the glossy paper. So just getting it back in and, and letting the Cricut do its business. I absolutely love seeing my hard work put together. Now these were all of the layouts that I was setting up the night before and now we get to see it all cut out and um, the fruits of the labor really mu really pretty much is the best way for me to explain it and I, I just, I, I love this process so much. It just all comes together in the end and um, a super fantastic time seeing it all done. And then I had one more layout that I needed to put together and of course I absolutely love it when my little man comes to hang out with me at least once a day he likes to come and chill on my lap and I will definitely allow him because it's just absolutely the sweetest thing in the world. And so you saw the big cutouts of all of my adorable alternative milks and now it's time to cut out the sticker sheet version because I want to give people options and I know I want these in every way possible because I absolutely love the way these came out and I could not be more satisfied with how these look. So after that I decided that I wanted to work on something else so um, I'm just gonna have the music play and have you guys enjoy a little drawing montage because I am having a puppy that is super whiny right now. It is almost time for us to walk her and that's why she's being a, a little bit of a mooch, but we love her for it. Anyways, enjoy guys. Oh my god guys, so my stickers are done. Let me show you all of my freaking hard work today. Look at all this. It doesn't look like much, but it really is. So these were the ones that I was showing you earlier in the week. My new um, version 2 planner 
sheet as well as I'm so in love with these still my little adorable milks my alternative milks um, special prize if you can guess what each one actually is what kind of milk it is this is for my patrons this is my um, my planner sheet for this week or this month then we've got the round deco stickers, which I am super stoked about. I've never tried this before, so it's the first time I've done something like this. Now these I just kind of made um, right at the end of the evening. And these ones are my, oh my goodness, I don't know what it's trying to focus on. Sorry, everyone. These are to remind me when to change my aligners, um, just because, you know, I don't have to change them every week now, it's every two weeks, so this is to remind me to change my Invisalign. And then we've got a matte, as well as a gloss version of these large stickers, and they're a nice, decent size, let me show you guys. Look at, look at that size, they're like, they're just so cute. I'm so happy with how they turned out. Um, the washi tape is back this month. I'm really happy with how these turned out. The other stickers that you'll be getting in the Patreon this month is a matte version of a cute little apple, my little elephant character. This one is a gloss finish. He's obsessed with croissants, so here is another little croissant. These are both um, gloss. This is the vinyl sticker for this month. It's another version of my little character. And then also, uh, you know, you got to have your little pot of all of your adorable markers and pencils and things like that because let me tell you, I have it here. <laughs> I actually have two. One was from work. I don't know what to do with the one that I had from work. We'll have to see what happens. But look at all this hard work. I am so happy with all of this, guys. So happy. Anyways, have yourselves a wonderful evening. And as you can tell, I didn't get to doing the photo shoot tonight. So I'll be doing the photo shoot tomorrow. And hopefully the lighting agrees with me. But have a good night, everyone. Hey, everyone. Bye. And happy Sunday. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. I did my nails last night. I'm super happy with how they turned out. I just put on my top coat today because I like to wait a little while before I put on a top coat. Um, I also effed up my finger. I, I owied myself this morning. I made uh, vegan eggs and scrambled eggs and hash browns with fresh tomatoes and basil from the garden. Uh, I posted that up on my Instagram story if you guys checked that out. So I'm really happy with um, the breakfast we had this morning because when I used to stream, um, it really didn't give me the chance to really make, uh, make my hubby and I some delicious food on Sundays, but I'm super, super happy that we were able to finally uh, make some good yummy food. I also made waffles a couple weeks back on Sunday So Sunday seemed to be the day that I like to make something a little bit more than just like hot cereal or you know um, a fresh bun with with like a pickled um, We like to do pickled What is it? fire roasted red pepper and that kind of stuff and I totally forgot that I needed to charge this battery These batteries are so freaking small I am so happy that I invested in getting two legit, because you could totally buy fake ones of these on the internet, but I really don't trust them. So I ended up getting another Canon battery. These guys are tiny compared to my digital SLR. Let me give you an example. See how much bigger my digital SLR is? This is so much bigger and lasts so much longer than this little dinky thing. I find um, after like last night filming, that is it. It is a toast battery. So I always have a battery ready to go just because like this is just too much. So I've got myself all set up here, all the things I want to take pictures of with my digital SLR. 
Um, one thing I wanted to note, I don't understand why this happened, but my, um, I don't know if I mentioned it last night, but my change aligners reminder, so only two of them turned out right, whereas the other two, they're misaligned and like really badly misaligned too. Let's try this again because my battery totally just died while I was in the middle of this and I think my finger is bleeding again. But okay, so if I get in really close in this with you guys, the tops aren't that bad for a cut line. It's a little bit bad, but it's not that off. But then as we go down, like look at how off these bottom ones are it's totally off so this is really frustrating um and i don't know how to fix this and i totally effed my nail there we go fixed 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 so i'm not sure why this happened considering the rest of these were totally fine um everything else that i was cutting yesterday was fine so i'm gonna have to like do I, I almost don't really want to do another cut of these though because I don't really think these are going to be all that popular these are just for me personally anyways because um now at the point of my aligners I only have to switch them every two weeks so just to keep track of it in my uh planner I really wanted something along these lines and there is no such thing on the internet so uh last night I totally just came up with this drawing really quickly and then um, just put it together and I think it turned out really great. I am so happy with how these little guys turned out and it, it, it kind of looks like he's wearing a little helmet so I thought that was really cute too. And the first time I printed them off I'm so angry because I ended up just leaving. I was so excited about printing these off that I totally forgot that the top of these ended up saying um, what I had used the previous. It, it was the um, pastel planner version 2 and I totally forgot that it said that so I needed to reprint these again this is what I get for being too excited okay like too excited is good problem right <laughs> so um so yeah I'm gonna do my photo shoot now that I've done my nails and everything looks really nice I'm also going to be doing a packaged order um, of all of my different Ollie stickers. I'm gonna make these as a set instead of just buying them individually. Those will also be up on my Etsy store, but I'm also gonna have a set available for people, which will be like a reduced price if you buy them all in one set. Um, just because I have so many of them and I think people would like them more as a set than individual, I think, personally. And then the other thing is that I want to do today is take pictures of um, some of my older wallpapers so that they're uh, downloadable for people. So I need to do like little photo shoots with them on my phone being like, you know, Vanna White kind of thing. Anyway, so that's my plan for today as well as editing this vlog for tomorrow. Um, I think I'll have some b-roll of me filming some of the, um, some of the, of the stickers but aside from that I am going to sign out and say you guys are fantastic and um, let's get into the work day bye guys <laughs>